And so off the tip, it's Brooklyn. To the middle. Here's Sampson. Offensive rebound. Outside Durant. And a miss there on the triple. And here is Adi Nkumbo. Six on the shot clock. Orlando needs to get off a shot. Releases. And it's off the back rim. No good. D giving him that shot, and that's probably not a good idea, but I guess they knew what they were doing that time. And stolen by Bull. Down low. Here's Fall. And at 7-2, Bull has incredible vision, including noticing when his teammates are open. Cunningham looking it over. Fires for three. Bender with the bucket. And that's exactly what he's looking for, draining the triple. To the inside. Here's Yao. Yeah, and indeed. finished off by Yao. Now check out Yao doing big man things. I mean, this guy's size makes those openings easy picking. And Giannis's journey, GA, is so incredibly compelling. A full-length movie made about his yes. and his brother's path to the NBA. Well, you hear that saying, my life is like a movie? Never truer than for Giannis. It's been an odyssey for the Greek freak. And stolen by Thomas. And how about the read on that play right there? Great sense of exactly when that ball was coming from the outside. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. And you can't forget about Bowles' brain. After all, big men like him are expected to take the three in today's game. And you know what? He doesn't mind getting his hands dirty when it comes to really fighting on the backboard. Not only fighting on the boards, he's converting, and not just on the putback. It's been a great Durant, start for him. Here's Sampson. Fires the three. Come on, come on. Back to Cunningham. Six to shoot. And the duck by Bull. The towering presence that is Bull. Good at staying active and going after those offensive rebounds. Assisted. Giannis. Mm, 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 that is ferocious. <laughs> you said it. That was ferocious. One is stuffed right through. And the one hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hands. And he's the one doing the slam. Agree. He is smooth as silk, even on a power finish. Now, here's Ani de Kumbo. They set the pick. Here's Bowl. It's deflected. And Samson literally takes away a part of the floor when he's out there. Don't even try to get shots off in this area, or that's what's going to happen. To the paint. Yao with the block. And finished off by Yao. My goodness, that was absolutely filthy. Ugh, nasty. This building is stunned. He dug deep, Greg, into his bag of tricks there. Pass to Sampson. Good, and the assist goes to Cunningham. Just getting it to the ready-to-fire guy. That's great recognition from Cade. Inside. Fall. Taco Fall. And the layup is good. Falls. Got eight. And those are the kind of nice inside looks they've gotten here in the first half. Out left to the wing. Cunningham outside. 
pass to Bull. Ah! Yao with the block. Ah! And, and you have to appreciate the reach of me. Superb at putting himself in a good position there to block the shot. That's just tremendous scoring instinct. So fun to watch him work in the half court. Durant deciding where to go with it. Over in the corner, Bender. A three. Good on the three-point shot. Bender's got his second basket. Nice answer back there. Love to see the competitiveness. Yeah, both teams finding ways to the three-point line and trying to take advantage from this. That's the end of the first quarter. It's the end of the first with a tie game here. And already these offenses 15, are clicking. The Orlando and the team. 15. Some good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after the first quarter of play. And uh, from Brooklyn guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? Just stretching out the floor in that first, uh, they had the defense scrambling. Pretty prime example here of how to space the floor and do it correctly. When you do it, that's the kind of thing that happens. Well, they're trying to take command of this game, but it's been competitive so far. Yeah, everybody trying to get away from one another, and the threads are keeping them close. This has been highly competitive. And stolen by James. Get there, get there. Well, the instincts on defense on full display there was a gamble for sure, but it paid off big time in the form of steal. First personal foul. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for Orlando. Right off the bat, they're going after the ball. Looking to jump into the passing lanes and create some steals in transition. Well, one thing that's noticeable is just tremendous energy from everybody, and they put that into their transition play, and all that hustle is paying off. Pass the ball. Down to five on the shot clock. No stopping him there. Jams it in as he's fouled. Chance now for a three-point play. Shooting for Orlando. It's on Kevin Durant. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. Brooklyn with the ball. Eight-point game. Well, in spite of the critics and the injuries, Paul George continues to produce one of the league's truly elite players. It's Orlando's ball. It's been eight unanswered points for him. To the inside. Stolen by Bender. And now they decide to foul intentionally. You're not sure what that was about. I mean, talk about a brain cramp. Team foul. Quarter number two with just over a minute gone. That's a two from Cunningham. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. And you mentioned the injuries for Paul George. Uh, let's see, GA, the broken leg, shoulder surgeries, last season a torn elbow ligament. And, and I'm sure there are a few others, Kevin. <laughs> but give him credit. To, to battle through and maintain his greatness tells you something about his competitive will. From deep, Orlando grabs the miss. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Second chance shot from the arc. Bender with the rebound. Brooklyn trails by six. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. And they go to the intentional foul. And it'll be Orlando with their first time out of the game right here. Time out on the court, charge door. And now your Brooklyn answer.
Here's Bender. He's got six. Pass to Cunningham. Five to shoot. From past the arc. Oh, drew the foul and almost hit the three-point bucket. But he'll go to the line to shoot three. Fourth team foul. You see the raw talent that Kate Cunningham has and the hard work and the proper focus. This guy is capable of big, big things. Well, you look at the counting numbers for Cade Cunningham. He, he fills up a stat sheet. The key for him moving forward, though, efficiency. And Banyama misses the three. Brooklyn trails by four. Bull can't hit. Second quarter of play with almost three minutes gone. It's good from long range. James has got himself on the board with three there. And you talk about Cade's efficiency, Craig and a struggling team, that can be a challenge. Yeah, without great shooters around him, he's forced into taking tough shots or turnovers. And as the team improves, though, I think the percentages should come around. Orlando leading by six. Number two, a oh, what a jam! Oh. Right, you knew something good was coming, Kevin. Oh. Right? Wow, and that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg, that is definitely an emphasis jam. A big apostrophe or exclamation point, maybe even a question mark. Right wing, the wide open look here for Perzingis. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. And here's KD 